Yeah, let's lighten the mood. Let's lighten um, the mood. Let's do it. So we're going to do like uh, Disney live action films today. But yes. um, I saw um, on something that Rocky was doing that he was talking about on TikTok. Oh, I didn't know this film was announced. So what I did was I pulled together a bunch of announced and unannounced films. So I'm going to list off like a film with some details about it. And then you guys can have a guess whether it's an actual film that Disney's making or... Ooh, okay. Oh, oh no. Everything is, is it with not AI to right the TV now? show, though? Oh, and it's not point. like we're not including TV shows. It's just movies, like theater releases. No, yeah, these are just... Got it. These are just specifically Disney live-action remakes of animated. Still oh, makes it hard. okay. Still makes it yeah, that's still hard. Yeah, okay. All right. yeah. Yeah. But I'm ready. I'm ready for the challenge. Television. Yeah, it does yeah, a little so bit. Like, okay. You know, the example would be like the Moana film is getting remade. With that's the Rock. true. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> well, we got the okay. Haunted Mansion movie coming out. That's true. Yeah. So they're making a live action Aristocat, Aristocats film no. directed oh. by Questlove. Oh, God. Okay. I think this movie came out when uh, All Dogs Go to Heaven came out. Uh, like, Aristocats. okay. And that's. I mean, listen. I could see them right, doing. Quest, it. Yeah. I think that that is. I think not they, I think true. it's a movie. I think it's not true. I think it's a movie. I feel like it is, but I'm gonna go the opposite of you. So it's not, and then we'll keep it the point. It was somewhat so, popular. I so, think they'll make it. Okay, so I'm gonna say it's not true. You, what okay. is it? That's true. Fuck. Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> okay. I just seems like Disney, right? No, that like, does seem like a Disney I, I thing. Like I said, I think that's true. I was just going opposite. Yeah, so yeah. All right. Yeah. One uh, on the board for yeah. Jason. Nice. They're remaking a live-action Cinderella with Margot Robbie attached. Oh wait, I don't know. No. They are doing a Margot, uh, or yeah, not a Margot Robbie. They are Margot doing a Cinderella, one. but they're not. I don't think Margot Robbie's attached. No, Margot so Robbie's no. too busy. That's the only. Yeah, I'm gonna say no. But there is a live-action Cinderella. I can't remember what character they want Margot Robbie for. It was something. Oh, they want her as Sue Storm. Oh, that's right. Yeah. yeah. Okay, what do you got? Yeah, that's that's not true. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right, I didn't cool. know they had her. They were doing a Cinderella. I'm pretty positive that there is a live action Cinderella well, coming out. I'm like pretty positive. I could be wrong. Just make Cinderella and Dea. Please, let's go. <laughs> Base chasing them over. <laughs> um, they're making a live action Hercules blockbuster. TikTok based musical with that Guy Ritchie directing true. and the Russo brothers. Oh wait, okay, so I don't know if Guy Ritchie <laughs> and, and the Russo brothers detailed. are doing it, but I know for a fact that they're doing a Hercules movie because it's somebody put it in my TikTok thing recently. Uh also there was a live action Cinderella movie that already came out no, yeah, in twenty fifteen. Yeah. yeah. So that's right. I I didn't really yeah, I, I can't didn't, remember what actress was the uh, Cinderella character. Yeah, but anyway, so uh so I fuck, I don't I don't know if Guy Ritchie is doing it, but just because it's, the fact that I know there is hard. one yeah. Why would Guy Ritchie do it though? I'm saying uh, I'm I'm gonna say false. Don't say false. Uh, I want to say, so but I never say looked up there. You're right. You're you tired me. But but, I, uh, but see, I need to. How many are there? I need to know how many. Like I have a chance at. Um, I'll do one, two, three, four, five. There's six more. Okay, perfect. Okay, so I can I take the. I'll take the risk. What did you say? I said false. It's true. Yeah, it's true. Fuck yes, let's go. Right Tied the I, board. It was so detailed. I knew this was. <laughs> I knew this was Russo brothers. Um, I think I was the one that commented this. I only just found out today it was Guy Ritchie directing. Oh, okay, that's <laughs> like, crazy. Wow, that was the last thing Guy Ritchie did? Be- oh, he did the movie this year. It was the Covenant. Guy Ritchie's the Covenant with um, uh, fuck, what was his name? Jake Gyllenhaal. Okay. Okay. It was a war movie. Yeah, about a guy in the Middle that's East. Oh, it was about the really Middle funny. Eastern, like um. Translator. Guy Ritchie's hit or miss. I think. He is hit or miss, but that movie apparently was really good. Okay. It's kind of a weird movie, though. This I is want... a really you know fun what? game. I'm going to have to with it. Like Cast John okay. Cena's Hercules. Jason, <laughs> why the fuck do you want John Cena and everything? It's oh, John Cena and Dave Batista. Right. That's all you ever yeah, say. John Cena and Dave Batista. No, he has a movie with John Cena on it. What is it? <laughs> They're making a live-action Tarzan film with David Leach um, directing and John Cena starring. Starring? Yes, I think that's yeah. true. <laughs> I think that I'm hoping it's true. At least I'm hoping. Yeah, it, having John Cena. Here's C. the problem: is that makes great. Nah. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna say. 
it makes sense on one level because like he is stupid like plays a good stupid he's not stupid but he plays a good stupid character right like a good funny yeah, he can stupid barely guy. speak english exactly and tarzan yeah. is also similar to that and he seems like he'd be down but to do anything that's the one thing sing. i like about john i try I, there's been bits of where he's trying to he's sing not and he can't sing, sing. Tarzan doesn't sing in the original. Why did you say that then? Just give him a song. Oh my god. <laughs> Just give John sing his song. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Uh, it's not true. And Jason, you said it's true. Yeah, I said it's true. Yeah, it's not true. Let's yeah. go. Oh, We're taking the lead. Okay. Maybe it will be. Maybe. <laughs> I could see that because he does play that. a good stupid guy. Yeah. I think yeah, uh, I James Gunn loves John Cena too He much does. Yeah, he's going to try to put him in every role. I'm fine I, with that. I haven't watched. Um, I've only just started watching WWE this year, but I could see like you know them pulling in someone else like Roman Reigns or something. I like. like I can see that. Actor. Yeah, I can. Any see man that. who battles leukemia and sister and still continues to wrestle afterwards, you have my respect. He's not the best on the mic, I will say, but you know he's, he's got, got no. His... Actually, he's got way better. I mean, I watched some of the like no you can pay per views with no. you. Wise men Paul Heyman is uh, pushed Roman Reigns. Paul Heyman is uh, great on the mic. Well, he's the greatest of all time. On the mic? Yeah, CM Punk doesn't even hold a Dude, candle. Dude, CM so. Punk is dog shit. I'm <laughs> right, sorry. Anyway. We're getting way yeah. off track here. I love John Cena <laughs> yeah. and Batista. Okay, yeah. I, yeah, of course you do. Yeah. I like John All Cena. Right. I use. I have like five John Cena shirts. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. See why you... <laughs> because I, I loved him when I was a kid. He was my favorite wrestler when I was like 12. Well, yeah, he was my favorite wrestler. But the problem is, is he sucks at fucking acting. What do you want me to say? No, but he's a, <laughs> he's less douchey Rock. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's way less douchey than The Rock. I'll he's, never say it. John like, Cena seems yeah, like if you met I'd him... I'd much so rather have John Cena than The Rock any day. The Rock. Yeah, sucks. absolutely. Okay, sorry. We're we're getting way off track. Yeah, no. Yeah. Um there's a Lion King spin-off prequel film. Oh yeah. That's um, true. That's true. That's true. Based on <laughs> Mufasa, directed by Barry Jenkins, the director of Moonlight. True. Yeah, true. True. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Damn. Okay, yeah. why did we know that? Well, I don't know. Because I already knew there was going to make a sequel to the live action. Yeah, Lion I think King. we talked about this. Like, 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 there was a ago. Lion King 2 that did come out that was. Like, yeah, we just like, talked yes. about this like five days ago, actually. That's why we both know. Yep. I, yeah. I don't I don't get like they're pulling in fucking Guy Ritchie, Barry Jenkins. Like, what's Dude, I mean, listen, they're Barry Jenkins is a fucking that great. They're like, oh, the problem was oh, the directing. Dude, what else that's did Barry that's Jenkins do recently? Barry Jenkins, oh, sorry. But yeah, he Barry Jenkins just did something recently that was pretty. Maybe I'll have to double check. Yeah, John but... Favreau didn't do too bad of a job of uh, live action Jungle Book movie. Yeah, but I'm also remember. a John Favreau stand. So yeah, that's true. So you're a bit biased. Yeah. Okay. What's the score? I don't think we kept three two. I think. Yeah. Well, now it's uh four yeah, three four three. Yeah. Okay. Four, four three. three. Yeah. Four three. We'll say four three. Fuck it. Four yeah, three. That's four three. You. They're doing a live action remake of the Lilo and Stitch film with the director yes. of Marcel. Yes. True. True. Yeah, true. <laughs> that's true. Wait, the yeah, director of Marcel true. the Shallow the Shoes on? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, yeah. Because I couldn't watch it because of the spiders. That? I have severe arachnophobia. Have you seen that movie? Have you seen any like clips from it? Um, I personally haven't seen it yet, no. So I, I like I think it's on like Peacock right now, but I it's very yeah, hyper realistic. Yeah, I think it's, it's like claymation it's super, mixed. It's like mixed with claymation, action. mixed with hyper realistic live seen, action. I've seen the trailer. Um, yeah, yeah, and they like he lives. Well, and it listen, has the it's, spider on I it. think Lucas it's the, the guy with the. Yeah, I'm pretty yeah. sure it's the guy from Lucas the Spider. I have no idea if that's true, but it makes it. It has these like hyper realistic well, we little spiders. Once we saw Lucas. Mm, uh, yeah, I can't. I have a severe arachnophobia. Like even in video games, like like so for example, Skyrim. That's there, how you I know went Spider-Man through. Is that great? Yeah, I watched it and yeah, was so like, amazed by it. I put through this was like, but there. I remember I went through the ice force and the whole game. I avoided. I didn't do the main story because I avoided caves and there was one cave at the beginning that I didn't go into that had spiders, and so basically. I remember I was walking through the forest one day. I completed all sorts of shit. And then out of nowhere, an ice spider dropped on me. And I immediately oh. threw my fucking controller, broke the bitch, turned off my TV, and I took the game back to Blockbuster that day. Anything that has spiders in it that I can't avoid, etc., I just can't handle. But Marcel the Show with Shoes On had a but really cool animation. Better since yeah, I've been. gotten better recently. Yeah. But definitely Marcel the Show with Shoes On was I like, think, um uh-huh. The um the thing that comes down and like um I'm trying to think of a way that's not spoilery. The machine in Spider Verse was that 
Oh, oh yeah, yeah that very, fucked. Very I hate yeah. how yeah. like it crawled and shit. Or there was like one scene where like, there was like the big spider on the side of the building while he was swinging. Oh through. yeah, yeah, Ugh. yeah. Uh, no, the or like the yeah, any of the scene or like when the spider goes through the like to the different dimension. Anything with that, like it was luckily cartoony enough for me to handle, it but it still game, yeah, triggered like, my arachnophobia. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, it was so good that I was like, I'm gonna keep watching. But yeah, it's very rare that movies can do that. But yeah. Yeah, okay. Um so they're also doing a live action remake of Atlantis with Villanueva. Is that That's, how you say that? Yes. The... Yes, Villanueva. That's true. Uh, and yeah. um I'm gonna say it's not true. Yeah, it's not true. Let's go. Yeah. That would okay. be really good though. That's that's one that, that I would be pretty that's fire. Pretty... I love the Atlantis. Uh, I, the, Atlantis I also so I watched good. it's such a great underrated movie by far. Like that came out I Titan A E. Have have you seen that movie? Titan A.E., Atlantis, and Treasure Planet are lit. Yes. Treasure Planet Back is lit. All three, yes. Treasure Planet is lit, and then my, is it the the big giant? Or what's the... Uh, my Gentle Giant. My Gentle Giant. I my love Gentle that movie Giant. as well, too. But anyway, I don't know what that's from. Oh, no, the, are you talking... The cartoon? The cartoon where there's the big, like, robot that, oh, like... Oh, my Iron... Uh, the Iron the Giant. The Iron Giant. Yeah. I love I don't know. What, is that Disney? What is that? My Gentle Giant was, like, uh, about a, like, extremely tall person. Oh, really? I think it was with Billy Crystal. That's yeah. hilarious. Okay. It's a great movie. I though. think I think the only downside now is we're probably going to get Atlantis at some point, yeah. but I feel like yeah. they're going to cast Milo as like Tom Holland and yeah. Wasn't it Michael J. Fox? Uh that was the vo- uh, he was either the voice in uh Atlantis or he was the voice in uh the other one that you said. Um but I'm pretty sure Michael J. Fox was a voice in Okay. Tre- or not Treasure Planet. Oh, uh, Treasure Planet. Was it yeah, Planet? it was Treasure. I'm pretty sure it was either Treasure Planet. Or I, yeah, Atlantis. I loved Treasure Planet as a kid. Yeah. I don't think I ever saw right. it. I just... I, instead of doing fucking that. Hercules with Guy Ritchie, they should have done Treasure Planet. <laughs> he should have. That would have been so lit. That That's deserves such a, a good fucking. It does, yeah. Uh, what's the. Um, there was one that was starts with an A, like An Umbrella or something like that. There was an anime mm-hmm. movie that came out around the same time as. Well, there's a, what's the one where there's a. Oh, The Emperor's New Groove? Yeah, oh, I love that, love that, that one. Was so good. That's a banger movie. We need the live action uh, that one, but they won't cast. Well, there's it the Emperor's New Clothes. That's re- uh, really good movie. Apparently. Oh, okay, I've never seen it. Oh, okay, was the it? um. Mm-hmm. So the last one, Sleeping Beauty, with Bryce Dallas Howard to star. Fuck! I hope that's not true. So I'm just gonna no, say not true. No. Yeah. No. <laughs> yeah, not true. Okay, thank God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I just can't I, um, see her. All no, right. There's no way. Well, I actually here, struggled going good, through good game. because yeah, good game. I was like, I was like, I'll pull up the animated films and I'll find a few that haven't been remade and I'll make some shit up. Yeah. There's very few that are not being remade. Like, no, that's well, it's so believable. I had to go all anyway. the way to like Atlantis in 2006. Yeah, that's yeah, very like, hard to do. Yeah, yeah. Fucking hell. That's a brand of Anastasia, sure. I think that's what Oh yeah, a- Anastasia. Uh, yeah, yeah. Great movie. That's a great movie. Great oh great. wait, she was a fine as fuck. Oh. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Jesus. Go ahead and continue. Right. 